today's story problem and thinking about how we're going to represent with the numbers that we know and the numbers that we're trying to figure out. Eyes on the story problem. My mother has 44 white plates in her kitchen and 33 purple plates. How many plates does she have all together? My mother has 44 white plates in her kitchen and 13 purple plates. How many plates does she have all together? Go ahead and, go ahead and represent using your part, part, whole box. Then we're gonna come back and you're gonna tell me how did you represent and why? We're back. How did you represent and why? Okay, I heard, I hear 44 part and 13 part. What else? Yes, a box to represent the unknown. And what is the unknown in this story problem? Yes, how many plates does my mother have all together? What's another way we can represent our story problem? Yes, you can use a number sentence. What would my number sentence look like? Tell me so I can write it. 44 mm -hmm. plus 13 equals unknown. Yes, equals unknown. Is there another way I can write this number sentence? What is that? Yes, 13 plus 44 equals yes, unknown. Go ahead and solve on your paper using a strategy that's going to help us to find the unknown whole. We're back. What strategy did you use and why? Good, you use count on. And why did you use count on?
Yes, it's gonna help us to get to our unknown goal. Good job. So let's do count on together. So what did you do first? Okay, you got 44 first. Then you boxed it in. Cool. Then you added 13. Nice. You counted on 13. Good. Let's do it together. 44. 54. 55, 56, 57. The number out of my mouth was what? Yes, 57. So 57 represents our whole, represents our... So how many um, plates does my mother have together? All, have all together? Yes, she has 57 plates. Now, it is your turn to use a strategy to help you find the unknown goal. Let's read the story problem you're getting ready to do on your own. There were 40 scholars on a field trip and 24 on another field trip. How many scholars were on a trip? Think about what you need to do to help you figure out how many scholars were on a trip. See you in the next video.